welcome to this video today we are going to talk about the field service if the business involves installation repair and maintenance of a product it increase the value for the customer and source of increasing revenue on odo we can create task organize by the project and adjust simply by drag and drop we save time and money increase the customer satisfaction and use of app on site can track the installation team which can be easily managed on odo 17 in the field service let's go and check out the field service so in the field service we have numerous views so this is by default coming in kanban view we can also explore it on list view map view calendar view gantt view pivot view graph view and activity so in order to make any task we can see there are number of tasks already existing so there is a installation install pipeline system so just go and look at this so we can see in we we need to give the name as install pipeline in the project just select the project which you want to uh required for field services worksheet template by clicking here we have multiple template for worksheet we can select any of them assign the person who has been assigned for this installation can be selected from here we can select one or more assignees in fact we can give tag to the um task so it is a bug experiment external or internal so on customer this is the very important part of this field service as the customer we select over here we can get the address by default where the installation team will go and do their work and in fact we can record the time of installation and the time spent on that particular project can be also uh, recorded over here we can find the phone number of the customer sales order on which sales order this installation is going to happen we can allot the time plan the date from which date to which date or from the same date let's say today is uh, today is 31st of jan so we can simply select the date as it is not coming just hmm go to january and we will select a time from 4:30 pm to 5 pm and apply so we can see time has been updated we have description over here so whatever extra information we can give for the task can be given over here let's say install pipe and we also have the option of time sheet which can be maintained and we can see in the time sheet also it will be automatically created sub task is there sub task related to installation pipeline system we can add over here we can give the title 
we can give the title assign the person as like we can again give any name and we can assign any of the one we want to and we have multiple option that for a task for a sub task there could be multiple assignees which can be selected from here so we will for now we will uh, delete the one we have some stages new planned and in progress so if the task has been started we have two option to manage this manually we can enter the hour or the minute spent if any description is required we can simply write the description and move ahead or we have an option of start just start this click the start and we can see seconds are moving on five six seven and so on so it will keep on running until unless we will mark it stop the moment we will stop it in the time sheet it will be registered let's go and stop this it is 15 seconds save it and we can see 15 sec seconds has been registered over here record has been created and if any description is there let's say uh, testing so we did it and we can plan also if planned just click on planned in progress and so on worksheet can be seen from here installation of pipe for manufacturer which manufacturer it is done model number serial number reservations uh, invitation type if you put first installation and description as per the requirement you can manually fill the record and save it get back to install pipeline if the work has been completed mark it as done or you want to send the report to the customer you can do it as well if there are any pending work you can again start and end the work as it is done we also have products we can see if any product is involved and the subtask can be seen the number of subtasks done over here can be seen over here as I have created a one which can be recorded over here we can also set the activities from here schedule the activities and let's consider that the installation has been done so mark it as done we can see it has been completed and the status uh, can be seen over here done so come to the task we have multiple options over here by default my task future or today or future date can be seen over here you can in fact put the filter and you can see open task closed closed on can be filtered from here we can also group by assignee status and so on so as we have select the assignee so inside mitchell john mitchell admin this task has been assigned if now let's go and see the map so what we can see the customer we selected can be seen on the map itself it used google map to show the customer site location we can also view all the tasks of assignees over here as you can see 
to scheduled if we want to schedule any task let's go and click here enter the task title project assignee tags as already i have mentioned if the work has been done invoice will be raised and according to the as the installation work i have completed so we can raise the invoice for it you can see create the invoice we can create the invoice and send it to the customer planning by user so in my previous video i have uh, make a video of planning just go and watch that video you will come across all the information of planning and scheduling the task by project all the project which are been involved in the task can be uh, seen over here by worksheet template whatever worksheet we are having we can check it from here reporting just go and click the reporting and you can see build services service project and we have certain um, views on which we can get the reporting part also as there are not much record over here that's why we are not able to explore much report but whatever task has been created updated or done you can find it over here let's come and check the configuration so in configuration we have project it's a separate topic which already i have uh, discussed in my previous video go and check out stages are also involved in this you can mention the stages new planned in progress done cancelled worksheet template we have multiple worksheet I will show you one worksheet name the worksheet company and the color if you want to put any discard this one product as in the previous video also I have discussed about the project product so you can go and check out from there tags it's a common uh, feature of Odo you have a flexible option to tagging something some task as it is a bug experiment internal external new feature so you can create also and also even as well as use this ta uh, tags activity type we have multiple activity type like we want to send the email call meeting to do remind and so on activity plan so we can also plan a activity or the task as per our requirement and so that the functioning of installation and the repair work can be done on time as well as with low costing and the process can move very smoothly and organization will not get confused at which and when the task was done or not done if there is any issue with the task it can be checked out by the task and so on so i hope this video is very much informative for you i have uh, covered almost all the topics of field services hope you like my video Thank you so much for watching this video. Goodbye. Like, share and subscribe our YouTube channel videos and you will be getting a lot. And yes, don't forget to comment upon these videos because if you comment on these videos, this will really going to give us the motivation to upload more and more videos. Thank you. Thank you so much. Stay tuned.